the Tarzan Yell. Now, there's a lot of controversy about Johnny's yell. In the novels, Burroughs had Tarzan give a victory cry whenever he made a kill or had something to celebrate. He never really described it phonetically, and it's left to the reader's imagination. Everyone sort of has their own idea. He said it was an earthly scream, that it you know, was inhuman, and at the same time, you could tell it wasn't an animal. And this yell would strike fear into the hearts of any who heard it, whether they were a big game hunter or a bad guy or just an explorer. Johnny Weissmuller has always said that he used to go to these picnics on Sunday when he was living in Chicago, and it was this German area, and they had yodeling contests. Oh, these were fun, and they yodeled, you know. A lot has been written about the Tarzan yell. Most of it, I think, is bunk, including the, the studio's uh, claim that it was a combination of animal sounds and that were, tracks were laid one on top of the other and so on. I mean, you don't have to be a whiz kid to figure out that that, that just can't be. According to film lore, MGM sound technician Shearer created the MGM Yale by mixing a variety of sounds. He had a hyena's yowl, he had a camel's bleat, he had a violin string being plucked, and a soprano singing a high C. Now, Maureen O'Sullivan always said that that was Johnny, right from the beginning, doing his yodel. End of discussion. And she's quoted that way. Whatever, whether MGM created or Johnny created it, it was evident that Johnny was able to master it and imitate it perfectly, because throughout his life, he was never shy about just cutting loose with the yell whenever and wherever he pleased, uh, usually much to the surprise of onlookers. I remember him very distinctly at the premiere of That's Entertainment in Beverly Hills. And uh, he got in front of the microphone and did his Tarzan yell, and it sounded older, but, you know, just basically the same. So if the first one was maybe created, you know, in the audio department or something like that, he learned how to do it, certainly. And don't forget, even Jane had her little yell, her Jane yell, her yodel. Yes, she did, but I can't do it. It was done by the sound department. I think she had a yell. Yes, she did. Definitely. Nice yell. A call. Let's call it a call instead of a yell. Well, the main thing is, the yell is great. And all the kids in America during the 30s and early 40s, they weren't around yelling like Johnny Weiss, or trying to yell like Johnny Weissmiller, and climbing the swing from the trees and do all of that. It was, it was big.